morning welcome back to another video and i'm going to be cleaning my studio today i just want to get right into it because there's so much to be done my studio doubles up as my dining area where i have meetings when clients come over where i film and where I also dry my laundry. So there's a lot that goes on in this space. I think it's like the most used space after the kitchen and the bathroom. And I just need to clean. So let's just get into it. I'm going to be sharing any tips that I think you guys will find useful around cleaning my machines, organizing fabrics, my tools, where I got different things from if you've not seen my original studio tour or studio reveal video. But let's get into this video. Before we start though, if you've not liked, honey, honey honey you know what to do please like this video because it helps the video and my channel a whole lot better perform a whole lot better on youtube so make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already and let's get into deep cleaning my space Laundry is all done. I have folded everything and like tucked it away. Put the collection in one of those wardrobes behind me. I should have just put everything in the garment bag because some of those fabrics are quite delicate and I don't want them to get um, mold or have the thread pulling. Lightweight um, rail to just assemble the clothes on. I have a more heavy duty one that I use when I do like pop-ups and things like that, but this one was like, it was really cheap. If I have a link, I'll put it down below. A new place, a new home for a while. Let me feel alive. Nothing to hold me back, take my time, just enjoy the ride. I know man, passing by, life is good, best I've ever felt. Get me up, so in, so where I can find myself. Okay, next up is this area. This is my Juki industrial sewing machine. If you haven't seen unboxing and setup video, I'm going to link it here this top side here so you guys can check it out i was so excited to get this machine the only thing i'm still struggling with is the tension i find that when i sew lighter fabrics the tension can be a bit too tight so i'm still trying to figure out the tension knob which i think is this one here on the front um but besides that everything else is really really good i love the speed Ooh. The speed of this machine was made for me like going through big orders has become so much easier so i'm just going to tidy up this area there's some packaging boxes here that um, my intern and i we sort of used to figure out shipping for the brand these are like the usual boxes i use this is my big box this is my small box and then this is my um i have like recyclable mailers that were custom made so i'm going to put these away put them in my iron and go this thing because it's very very dusty that machine is so dusty Somebody 
that I used to know Some I am my enemy I don't wanna fight no more Origami on the floor Breaking stuff that's so sentimental Push and pull is all we do Life is hollow without you down this table and set it up so I can actually use it to eat just using like normal surface cleaner just wipe it down this table I got from Ikea I don't even think Ikea does this table anymore that's how long ago we got it we got this when we still lived at our former place um, in central and it's one of those tables that you can pull out the sides to make it long or push it in to make it more like a like a square ah, this table has suffered i have drawn i have cut as in the markings on this table are markings of love that's all i can see that's so sentimental push and pull is all we do life is hollow without you Say the messiest <laughs> and where I spend most of my time in a typical week and this is where I would edit this is where I would do emails this is where I would often plan because I'll have a seat here then I'll write in any of my journals also on this side is my um, fabric scrap baskets I just need to tidy these up a bit I think I might even need to get a third one because I am in need of a third one so i think i'll get a third one here i put it where this pink stool is these i got from wilco i think they are just normal laundry basket but i love the fact that because they are like brown woven material like raffia type material it goes with like the other brown furniture in the space like the wardrobe the table the chair the frame the mannequin even like the the pots for the plants they are like different shades of brown so i like to stick to that like brown like family color group get rid of like random bits of paper and fabric and just make it look organized so my brain feel organized i think once i do that tidy this then i'll hoover and the space should be clean
Live your life within the moment, moment And don't go wait until the morning, morning You never know when it is over, over All that I know is we'll get older, older So let us dance this night away If you enjoyed the video don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you'd like me to make this a series let me know in the comment section as well so i don't know every couple of weeks we could clean up together and i would share any tips i have or i remember or any like useful suggestions on how to use like a space like this in a way that makes sense for you know startup fashion businesses but that's it for this video if you enjoyed this video let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below and until my next video, have a good morning, afternoon, and evening, wherever you are. Bye! Live your life within the moment, moment. And don't go wait until the morning, morning. You never know when it is over, over. All that I know is we'll get older, older. So let us dance this side away. Can't see